certainly piked with a set of python bindings for theft libraries which can be used to create cross-platform applications with a graphical user interface GUI. in this tutorial we'll cover the basics of getting started with piked including installation creating a simple GUI application and understanding the structure of a piked application prerequisites one python ensure you have python installed on your system you can download it from Python or Gatsu Python or Downloads. Pyke to you can install Pict5 using pip. Open your terminal or command prompt and run bash pip install Pict5 creating a simple Pict application. We'll create a simple Pict application that contains a window with a button. When the button is clicked, a message box will appear. Step 1. Import the necessary modules. Start by importing the necessary modules from PICT5. This class will set up the GUI components. Step 3. Initialize the application now. You need to initialize the application and run the event loop. Imports. We import the required classes from PICT5. Quidgets. My app class inherits from Quidget, which is the base class for all GUI objects in PICT. A push button is created and connected to the show message method. Main application execution. The application is created and executed in the main block. Running the application to run the application, save the code in a file named meapp.pa and execute it using python bash python meapp.p conclusion uv now created a simple picked application. From here, you can explore more complex widgets, layouts, and signal slots in Pyked. Pyked supports a wide range of widgets like text boxes, lists, tables, and more, allowing you to build feature-rich desktop applications. For further learning, consider checking out the official PIC documentation at Woo, Riverbank Computing, Comstatic Docs PIC 5 for more details on widgets and layouts. Happy coding!